and my last guest of the day. This one is a special one because uh, Friday is the Lover's Day and she did something special for the lovers. Lillian Awangari, founder of Let Cream and Flavors Bakery, is in studio with us just to share a story with us. Karibu sana. Asante. All right, your camera is number four. Okay. Uh, I think you know the drill now. You've been around for her. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'll give you a chance to introduce yourself, okay. uh, just in case I miss anything. Okay. Uh, then we get to the what matters most. Okay. All right. Just look them straight into the eyes, right? <laughs> okay. Uh -huh. My name is Lilian Ongare. Uh -huh. I'm the founder and CEO of Rakrim Bakers. Uh -huh. We deal with uh, matters with cakes. Uh -huh. We do from wedding cakes, graduations, uh -huh. uh, cere any ceremonial cake uh -huh. we can make. Any ceremonial yes. cake. Yes. And today, and this week being a lover's week, uh -huh. we decided to do something amazing uh -huh. for Valentine's Day. Uh -huh. Yes. And this is what we have in studio with us right here. Yes, right now. yes, yes. And uh, this is a display of your work. Uh, but you say uh, you said any ceremonial cake. What about yes. private cakes? <laughs> <laughs> Some anyway, of us love private. <laughs> yeah, even private we do. Even private. Yes, you do. any cake you can think of, we can create. All right. Yes. Wow, your cake is as beautiful as you are. Thank I'd you. I'd like to know how long did it take you to get as good as you were at this? Uh, it has taken some few years. Mm -hmm. You know, practice, practice, it makes mm -hmm. perfect. Mm -hmm. And with the change, uh, you need to keep changing and evolving. Mm -hmm. Yes. All right, uh, so what, uh, I'd like to know your background first. Okay. Uh -huh. So I started back in 2016. Mm -hmm. It was, uh, first, at first it was a passion. Mm -hmm. You know, well, bake cakes at home, bake mm -hmm. for You're families. You're making it for family, uh, yeah, for they, your friends. They just look funny. Uh -huh. <laughs> and then in 2017, that's when I decided, I think it's serious. All right. So we need to get serious. When you realized, I need to take this a notch higher, what were some of the things you figured, all right, I need to f work on this, work on this, work on, and work on that? At uh, first, I, I needed to work on my skills, because mm -hmm. I didn't have so any... skill back. is number one. Yes. You cannot start a business without having the uh, appropriate skills. Yes, yes, right. yes. So I needed to get uh, to acquire skills for baking, mm -hmm. where I joined uh, a bakery, just mm -hmm. for one, because I had, I had the basics, uh, mm -hmm. so I just needed to polish up what I had. Mm -hmm. Then, uh, obviously, you need capital. Mm -hmm. Capital and, uh, is number two. Skills, yeah. capital. Yes, capital okay. is number two. Mm -hmm. Then I think... Uh, I'd like to know how you jumped over that hurdle right there, the capital hurdle. Uh -huh. <laughs> it was challenging because, uh -huh. uh, first of all, I was employed. Uh -huh. So I had to resign mm -hmm. and uh, just take a deep, you know, mm -hmm. a deep dive. All right. Yeah, it was a risk. It if was I a can risk. Say, a very big right. one. How did you, play, uh, did you prep yourself for resigning? Because so many people are thinking about it, but nobody has the guts. <laughs> Uh -huh. Yeah, it took time. I uh -huh. think a year and a half before I like decided I need to do this. Mm -hmm. So it was just uh, this this year you say I'm resigning. Then mm -hmm. next year comes and you're like, uh, let me just hold. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so it got to a time and whatever is inside you, you know, when your dri when your dream drives you, mm -hmm. it gets to a point and you're like, you know, I can't do this anymore. Let mm -hmm. me go do my own stuff. Mm -hmm. Yes. All right. So uh, so the best thing is not to tell anybody I'm going to resign next year. No, you need a plan. You need a plan? Yes. And keep it a secret. <laughs> yes. <laughs> All right. Yes. So, number three, you need, uh, the capital is number two. Yes. Uh, number one, we said... Our skill. The skill is very important. Very important. Then the capital. Yes. And then tell me the, 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 the number three. The number three, now you need a plan because uh -huh. you can't just go do something blindly. Mm -hmm. So, you need to work on the market, your market, who will mm -hmm. be your customers. Mm -hmm. You need to look at um, uh, the, the diversity of the industry that mm -hmm. you're going in mm -hmm. so that you can get to understand how even you start marketing yourself mm -hmm. how you reach to customers mm -hmm. yes so it took a lot of research for you yes sure. uh, for you to understand your market yes all right so what are some of the tools you used for research um, online Online? Yeah, online. Obviously, everybody's just, on yeah, Facebook. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then uh -huh. uh, interacting with a few friends, mm -hmm. the young people, mm -hmm. what the market is, even the bakers who are already in the market. Mm -hmm. Yes. So you talk to the guys who are doing something similar to what yes. you are doing. Yes. The potential customers yes. are also very important. Mm -hmm. And uh, the haters are also very important. Yeah, sure. <laughs> they keep you going. <laughs> All right. Yes. So maybe you can share with them your social media handles. Okay. So they can check you guys out uh, as we carry on. Okay. Your camera is number one. So we are in Facebook. Mm -hmm. That is Rakrim Flavors Bakery. Uh -huh. You can check us in Facebook. We have shared a lot of our cakes that we have done from birthday, housewarming, baby shower. So you can check us in Facebook and also WhatsApp. Uh, Facebook, there are, uh, there are contacts that mm -hmm. you can reach us on WhatsApp. Mm -hmm. Yes. All right. So uh, that is it right there. You're present online. The skills are in check. Uh, you invested in yourself and now you're doing it. What are some of the the hurdles that you didn't see coming in this 
because many people might consider this something simple because people cook every day yeah, yeah, sure. uh, for themselves and their families so they think it's an easy thing mm. to turn it into a business what are some of the hurdles you've come across um, I think the most challenging one has been uh, how to handle the orders. Because eh? mm -hmm. sometimes customers will give a late order because mm -hmm. we make fresh cakes. Mm -hmm. There's nothing that has been in the fridge for so long. It's just Please fresh. tell me that is your oh. cash <laughs> yes. Fresh cakes. Yeah. Fresh cakes. They are right. freshly baked. Uh -huh. eh? So some customers will give a, dead, a, a, late, a, a, late, a late notice or order mm -hmm. and you're supposed to make it on mm -hmm. that day mm -hmm. so when you tell them it's not possible at some point some of them don't take it very politely uh -huh. but now you know we are we are we are based on uh, quality is our first our mm -hmm. main our main character mm -hmm. so we can't uh, do a cake very fast so mm -hmm. that we we, we 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 make your order uh -huh. and then at the end of the day it doesn't satisfy you all right so, so maybe we'd rather that's a, not deliver uh, yeah yeah than deliver substandard yes. products yes 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 all right mm. this has got you so far yeah and uh this how, how <laughs> Have you always been like this or you learned this at a particular point in your journey? No, you, you learn. Uh -huh. You learn. You know, when you start a, when a, a company is starting, mm -hmm. there's so many things that you go learning on mm -hmm. the way. Mm -hmm. You go learning, you know, we need to do this, we need to, because you're, you're setting a structure for something that is going to grow big. Mm -hmm. So you need to set the, 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 the right structure mm -hmm. when it's really small. Mm -hmm. So as you go, as you handle different customers, because clients are different. Mm -hmm. So as you handle the this one, different. yeah, so as you Absolute handle this different. one, you handle this one. So you know the next one, uh -huh. I'll do this one so that I serve him or her better. All right. Yes. So it's a learning process. Sure. As much as you have to remember the three key yeah, points. Yeah, 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 yeah. Skill, capital, and uh, planning. And planning. Yes. Uh, it's a learning process yes. that you need to understand for sure. Mm. All right. So uh, I'd like to know, uh, <laughs> Coming from employment mm. to running your own business, do you have some employees right now or some people that you correlate with or co-work with yes, to make I, your business? Yes, I have. Uh -huh. eh? But uh, at the moment, we are doing part-time. Uh -huh. Like when we have uh, many wedding cakes or many orders, mm -hmm. I, I call some few people, uh, I think two. Mm -hmm. And maybe sometimes you need uh, help with delivery because mm -hmm. maybe you're taking one thing to town, another one to Thika. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. you need different people to do that. Uh, yes. All right. So... Uh, I'm sorry to tap into this stereotype, but <laughs> okay. I have to. Not so many, <laughs> not so many people expect a woman to run, to own and run a business. It's a stereotype that is around, especially in Africa. Yes. Uh, <laughs> women have been on the sidelines for a very long time mm -hmm. in the corporate world. Uh, but as a woman, uh, do you feel? <laughs> all right. Do you feel like? Uh, the space is there for women to own businesses. Do you feel like they take women seriously in this corporate world that you're getting into? I, uh, my take would be, uh -huh. I think whatever you offer on the table mm -hmm. is what makes people take you serious. Because mm -hmm. if you say you're going to deliver a cake a certain way, you should do that. You should keep your word. So if you do that, they come to respect you. Yes, you're a woman, but your work is speaking for itself. Mm -hmm. Yes. Thank you very much, man. And uh, we have a cake right here. And this yes. was made specially for Valentine's. Yes. All right. So maybe you can, we, we can check this cake out <laughs> as we talk more <laughs> about Valentine's. And uh, you seem to be taking advantage of all these holidays that we have. Yes. How yes, was Christmas yes, first? <laughs> <laughs> Christmas was great. Uh -huh. We made a Christmas tree, uh -huh. which was all cake. I could eat anything from the yes, tree. Yes, yes, yes. It was amazing. Right. So business is always good. Doing <laughs> yeah, all yeah, this. Yeah. What do you have uh, lined up for Valentine's Day? So Valentine's, we have uh, orders. You can mm -hmm. uh, this this time we are focusing on chocolate because mm -hmm. I think I'm a love of chocolate. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. so on Valentine's, that makes it uh, us. yes, mm -hmm. yes. <laughs> so we have an offer for mm -hmm. fifteen hundred for one mm -hmm. kg uh, chocolate cake. Mm -hmm. One yes. kg chocolate cake. Yes. All right. So uh, how do you relate cakes? Uh, with love, how can we relate that? <laughs> I think it's 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 uh, with the, what I feel mm -hmm. or how you 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 relate with love. Just tell me your life story. <laughs> <laughs> You're open for that as yeah, well. Yeah, so you just need to make a cake that even if you see it yourself, you uh -huh. just fall in love with it. All right. Yes. So the secret is make her fall in love with the cake. Yes. And she's going to fall in love with it. <laughs> 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 yeah. <laughs> Please remind them your social media handle. Uh, Rakrim Bakers, uh -huh. Facebook. Rakrim Bakers yes, on Facebook. Yes. Are you on Instagram? 
Uh, not yet. We are still yet. working. It's You're under still working construction. On Facebook. <laughs> All right. So uh, I've come. I've interacted with uh, so many communities of bakers. Mm -hmm. there, there's the Bakers Club. Yes. Uh, we have communities of bakers. Mm. What is the importance of involving yourself in these circles of people who do similar things uh, to what you do? Uh, it's very important because mm -hmm. you share the same problems. Mm -hmm. You share. You are able to understand one another because mm -hmm. you're in the same field. Mm -hmm. So if this customer is dealing, is if, uh, if the, uh, one baker is dealing with. Uh, with this kind of a problem mm -hmm. you're able to help one another mm -hmm. and then you're able to polish up your skills with mm -hmm. seeing what the other people are doing mm -hmm. yeah so you can't stay on your own you need to interact with them interact with people who do similar things yes, to what yes, you do yes, yes. networking is the future yes all right please remind them the top three tips of <laughs> <laughs> running your own business so you need to have top. skills mm -hmm. you get you acquire the right skills mm -hmm. you need to have uh, finance capital is key capital is very yes important. and then you need to have a plan you need to have a plan. Yes, then All you're right. good to go. <laughs> uh, so I'll give you a chance uh, to talk to them because uh, I, I know there's so many lovers who watch why in the morning. Yes. And uh, it's only four days before then. Uh, so just talk to them and uh, tell them uh, that <laughs> <laughs> tell them what they can get from you if they interact with you on that Facebook page that you were talking about. Okay. Uh -huh. So uh, to all my clients out there and my potential clients, mm -hmm. uh, love is a beautiful thing. Mm -hmm. So and it wouldn't be any beautiful if you. Mm -hmm. Uh, you offer a present mm -hmm. like now this cake is full of chocolate handmade mm -hmm. the chocolates are handmade mm -hmm. so you can imagine what it can do to a heart <laughs> when you and give someone a, like a heart yes, <laughs> full of chocolate and it's a chocolate cake so <laughs> it's amazing <laughs> remind them remind them the facebook page so my facebook so we can page get to eat this cake i'm looking forward to it so my facebook page is rakrim flavors mm -hmm. bakery uh -huh. yes all right thank you very much for coming through. you're welcome we appreciate you thank so much you. and keep doing what you're doing and uh, as I say to the other guests that we had, I'm looking forward to seeing like Green Bakeries on the Nairobi Stock Exchange. Thank you. <laughs> All right. we so we have there. come to an end of Entrepreneurship <laughs> Tuesday. It's about that time that uh, we eat this cake. Uh, Valentine has come early uh, at Y254 <laughs> Studios, courtesy of us. <laughs>